welcome back to my channel happy monday i hope you guys are having a great day so if you guys follow me on instagram you will see that i did not um upload a video yesterday and it's not because i don't want to but i did film my plan with me video and i tried filming it on my new phone and i guess the settings were off and it just did not look good like the quality was not great and i was just not happy with it so at first I thought it was maybe just like an editing issue and where I can fix like the lighting and the contrast and all that stuff. So I edited it two times. I ended up uploading it two times and when I rewatched them I just did not like it because um, it definitely looked different on the camera than what it did on my desktop. So that was just not good. It was a waste of my time and not only that but my video I loved it and I did all of my spreads with you guys and it took the video was like almost 40 minutes long I took my time I was having fun with it I was excited and then I just I lost it so like now I don't have that footage because it, the quality is not great so I'm going to share with you guys all of the spreads that I created in that video, the items I used, and then we'll just do a little bit of planning here and there. And then after this, I'm going to film my Tutorial Tuesday video, and hopefully you guys enjoy them. I'm back to filming on my old phone. I think I'll keep doing that for now until I can figure out the settings on my new one. Although I got to say, the camera is amazing on my new one. And my Instagram pictures, like, they come out so, so pretty, and I love the quality. And I just have to figure out the settings for the video portion. But, yes. <laughs> Sorry, I had to help my puppy get up on the chair. Um, Alright, so where do I start? I'm going to show you guys the stickers that I used, and then I'll explain which ones I used and why. So, yesterday I pulled out this little sticker sheet. I love it. It's by Craftology. I'm not sure if this is a Dollar Tree sticker sheet. I think that brand is from Dollar Tree. But these are like little 3D pop-up stickers. And because they are nice and thin, I was like, I think I can use them. Right? Because they're not so puffy and they're not so thick where they'll make my planner like super chunky and hard to write in. So I thought these were cute. I gave them a try and I loved it. And then... I have these super cute stickers which I used in my plum in my paper Sunday work planner and they came out so pretty. I had gotten these from Marshalls years ago and I just love them. I feel like you can use bunnies all year round and then the florals are still a spring theme. I'm still probably going to be using bunnies here or there throughout the month of April just because it's Easter month and I love to try to use all my stickers. And then I remembered I had these stickers right here. They were so cute. I was obsessed with them. And I do not remember why I didn't grab two of each because I'm pretty sure Michaels does not carry these anymore. But I'm obsessed with them and I love them. And these are some super fun, colorful spring theme ones. And then you also get like the little puppies. And these are more like iridescent colorful ones like glittery matte glitter they're so pretty and I did use some of those then I used these these are the butterfly ones so you get a large solid sheet then you get a medium with the sparkly iridescent and then you get the puffy ones so cute and as you can see I still have some leftovers so I can still use them in the rest of my spreads if I want to use them for April again so then I have these right here these are beautiful I think these are my favorite ones these have like little Easter eggs and large florals and um, they have like the super cute little bunnies and I used these in my happy planner and oh my god I fell in love with the spread and then you got the little puffies they're just so, so cute. So I used those. And then I also have these. I was going through my stickers and then I'm like hmm, trying to figure out like which ones I can use. And somebody had sent these to me in some Happy Mail. I think it was a combination of a few different people. And these are super fun. These are like a galaxy theme almost. And then these are some fun for like, I don't know, for maybe like um, months like January, March, um, February even. And then these. These are so cute. I really like these because I do believe these are like spring theme colored stickers. And so I used these little sets right here. 
I used set number one, which is this one right here. Isn't that cute? And then I used set number two. I love that. So I used those, and then as far as the washi tape goes, I used this, gorge, this gorgeous washi tape. Um, I forgot where it was from. I did name it in the video. Um, but it's a beautiful washi. It's really thick. It's like a really thick plastic, but I was still able to break it with the um, with the gift card. And it has like these gorgeous little like blossoms, and they're glittery, and it's just so pretty. Then I had I used this iridescent, almost like a pearl white one, super gorgeous. And then here's another gorgeous pink one I don't know I don't think I used this one but I'll definitely use it in my next one I feel like it'll go nice with that set right there and then I also used this one <laughs> sorry my dog keeps barking and then I used this really really pretty pink one it's like this one but this one has like little like pearls in it and this one has like stripes and but it's iridescent and it's a like a soft pink and it's so cute then I also use this one right here it has like a lace down the middle it's white and pink super pretty I use this um, white and gold striped one I'll show you how this is a really pretty one too love that it's like a gold foil and then I used these as well so Let's go ahead and get into my spreads just so that you guys can see how I decorated them. My pictures will be up on Instagram if you want to see them. Uh, look at how cute it is. So as you can see, I did a combination. Another fun thing that um, I had talked about yesterday in the video that I filmed was the use of the washi tape. So I'm trying to find different ways to use my washi tape in these planners. Um, just because there is like limited spacing and so by alternating both the white blossoms with this like um pink i just love how it looks i think it's perfection and i added the white blossom wash tape at the top on both so they're like cohesive then I added it right here, and then in the top right here, and then I did the pink. And when I added this pink, I knew I wanted to add it to this page. So that's when I decided to alternate them, and I thought it was just perfect. I absolutely love how it turned out. Then I added all of my little stickers. I did a combination of the solids with the like little glittery um, bunnies, and they're just so cute. Over here, I added goals this week because this is says errands, but you know, I'm not really going anywhere. And then over here it says important. And up here where it has the dinner plans, I just put don't forget. And then I covered the Monday through Sunday um, with this little bunny right here. And I absolutely love it. So super cute. Um, I just put charge my phone memo printer, which I did because I'm gonna be adding a few pictures here. And then I put my film, edit, and upload, film and edits, and then film, edit, and upload my pictures. So we can work on this really quick right now. I'm going to go ahead and see um, what I can print. So the one thing you do have to do with your foam memo printer, if you guys don't know, this foam memo printer is so cute. It does not require ink. And I've used it very little bit, and I just, I love it now that, you know, I can use my foam while on camera um, I have more access to it so you, it does not require any ink it solely you just have to charge it turn it on connect it via Bluetooth and then download the app and I'll show you guys the app right now so you guys can see what it looks like let me make sure it's on my Bluetooth so just connect it to your Bluetooth it's the mister <laughs> dot in then just hit done when you click on it and then the app is right here, it's the phone memo app, so when you click on it, you'll see it says scan, notes, print images, templates, it has the cutest things, and then, oh, let me connect it. So you go to here, select the printer, hmm, it's on, I don't know why, I'm all true. 
Oh, duh, I gotta turn it on. Just hold it, there you go, and it's on. And then it should be coming up over here somewhere. There we go, so connect it. And then it says connected. So if you go to notes, you can write down any like little notes that you can also, you can write in like the little bubbles. You can also, um, you can also use like a table or you can do like images, right? You can also scan a picture from your phone. And then like, for example, I'm going to print this Mickey Mouse right here. And then you just go to print and then it comes out automatically isn't that the cutest thing so one thing I do um, you could rip it off but I just like to use my scissors cuz this is their new paper too um, it is like um, like a clear paper so you'll see how it comes out right now I'm gonna go ahead and just cut it right here I think it's so cute and I'll just leave a little bit of space in case I want to buy anything, but I'm going to go ahead and put them down right here. It says, laughter is timeless, imagination has no age, and dreams are forever. Isn't that cute? So I'm going to go ahead and print one more just so that you guys can see. So when you charge it, um, it comes out nice and bold. And then once your charger is running out, then the ink diminishes. So you won't have as much ink. And then I'm going to print out one of my spreads. So let's see. I think I'm going to go ahead and do this one, which is this spread right here. And it's going to come out. Ah, that's so cute. So then I'm just going to go ahead and cut it. And you can also write like little to-do list and print them out and I'll show you how to do that. I do have a coupon code down below too if you guys want to check it out. And then we'll just put it right here. And then over here I'll just make a little note. Um, I'll put this week's bread. There we go. Cute, right? And so that's how you use that. And then I'm going to show you guys how you can make a list too. If you go to templates, over here they have like little fun templates so when you print it it'll print it out in that shape and then you can write your little note like for example the penguin in the belly or you can make little to-do list and you can fill it in yourself and then it'll print it out that way or you can do like little frames and what's cute is for holidays they do um, all kinds of they'll put in like Christmas templates or Halloween templates and then you can also do like a little schedule <laughs> isn't that cute I love it. So I'm just going to go ahead and print, um, just so that you guys can see, we'll do this one. And then you can input, um, let's see, what should we put on it? All right, so I just put for my little to-do list, micro TN using Project Life Cards, and then TN folder using my new metal dies. So then we're going to go ahead and print, and it's going to come out just like that right isn't that cute so it gives you the option so you can insert whatever you want to insert and then you can take it off just like that and then you can take it off and then you can paste it on here so I think I'm actually just going to put it right here. Just like that. Oh, it's a little crooked. 
And there we have it. Isn't that pretty? Oh my goodness, I love it. So today I'm gonna go ahead and upload my plan with me video. And then I'm going to upload tomorrow. Okay, and then we'll film and edit. I don't know what I'm going to do for Friday's video yet, so I'll leave it as is. And then I don't know what else. Sunday is definitely plan with me. So... Perfect. And that's it for that one, you guys. Alright, so then for the next one is my Paper Sunday Planner. This is the spread that I created. And again, it was using this super cute thin washi tape with the gold foil and then the little bunny stickers right here. So super, super cute. I love it. It came out really nice. Tomorrow, um, I'm going to work from 9 a.m. to 10. And then I'm going to sign back on 11 a.m. To, um, what is my normal shift? I think it's 5.30. Yeah, to 5.30. And then I have a meeting and then morning emails. Perfect. And that's it for that one. I'll do everything else as I go for the week because I just don't know what my plans are for my work week. And I love that. And then in my plum paper planner, I'm going to show you guys my spreads. This was my Easter spread, Easter Sunday. I love it. And then this was today's spread right here. I added the little 3D stickers right here. And as you can see, they're nice and thin, so they're not too bulky, and I love that. And I just put in like some of my little notes and I love how that one came out. Then for this one, that's uh, Tuesday, April 11th. That's what that looks like. Put a little note there. And then for Wednesday, April 15th, that's what that one looks like. I love it. It's so cute. And then here we have Thursday. April 16th so pretty using those Dollar Tree stickers very simple but I just love how it all came out Friday April 17th Saturday April 18th and then Sunday April 19th I love this one I love her she's so cute so I'm just going to go ahead and pop in the little notes that I wrote down with my little sticky notes and then we'll just kind of continue like that. So so laundry bed sheets and then um, chicken uh, All right, then we got water. And then um, doctor's appointment. I'm gonna do it virtually, like um, via video at 10 a.m. And then, um, what else? I don't know what I'm going to buy or order. I just put Stop and Smell the Roses in the daily quote, and that's it for now. And then I just made a note here. I want to make sure to declutter. Okay. 
And then my boyfriend is going back to work, so. There we go. And that's it for that one. This is going to be the same thing for now. Water. Vitamins. And that's pretty much it, you guys. That's it for now. That's all I have um, that I can think of. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. And thank you guys so much for watching. And again, I'm sorry that my video got... Um, um, I guess you can say discombobulated <laughs> and um, either way I hope you guys still enjoyed today's video and thank you guys so much for watching as always if you did enjoy give it a big thumbs up it really helps me and my channel out and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're new to my channel welcome I hope you decide to join our planner family I love you guys and I'll see you guys on the next one bye